hey my loves welcome back to my channel and welcome if you're new so in today's video i'll be sharing this simple yet effective skincare routine that has helped me to remove acne and to reduce the appearance of dark spots on my skin so the first step is to start off with the CeraVe hydrating cream to foam cleanser for normal to dry skin it is fragrant free it contains amino acids and it is great for removing dirt oil and makeup it is quite gentle on the skin and it is very non-drying so the second step of this process is to use one of my favorite things on this planet and it's aloe vera i use aloe vera in a lot of my hair care routine and i also use it on my skin because it's great for hyperpigmentation and just for giving your skin that natural tight feel so it's nature's botox in a sense and the final step of this process is to use the CeraVe moisturizing cream and it pretty much moisturizes and helps to restore and protect the skin's barrier like the hydrating foam to cream cleanser it is fragrant free and it contains hyaluronic acid so you know that helps retain the skin's natural moisture so to start this process off i'm simply going to go ahead and damp my face after which i'm going to go in with the CeraVe hydrating cream to foam cleanser so it's pretty strong so you don't need more than just a little dollop and then you would simply rub that in your hand and apply it to your face in a circular motion so if you have one of those brushes that you use during your skincare routine then that would be perfect to use for this step so you need to continue to massage for two to three minutes in the circular motion just to really get the ingredients in this cream to foam cleanser in your skin because i guarantee you that this will be a game changer in your skincare routine Now once those few minutes have passed, the next step would be to wash the cleanser from your face and you want to ensure that your eyes are properly closed to avoid any possible contact and you're going to wash your face thoroughly and I like to allow my face to air dry. I don't pat it with a paper towel or with a cloth towel. I like to allow my skin to air dry. So before going into the next step, I'm just going to give my skin a few minutes to air dry and then I'm going to go in with the aloe vera. So my skin has been completely dry and you can tell that it's looking a bit brighter and clearer. So I'm just going to go in with the aloe vera and again, I tend to like to massage the aloe vera into my skin in a circular motion as well. And as I said earlier, aloe vera has so many benefits, not just for your hair and skin, but also for your body. And I tend to try my best to include aloe vera in all my hair care routine and in my skincare routine as well. So aloe vera, as I said earlier, is nature's natural Botox. When I use aloe vera, my skin feels a lot tighter and lifted. So I include aloe vera pretty much for that step to help with the tightness and firmness of my skin and also to help with reducing the appearance of dark spot. So again, I'm just going to allow the aloe vera to sit on my face for a few minutes and allow it to completely dry because that is the method that I find that works best for me. And it's also a way that the aloe vera will be able to be washed off your face easily when you allow it to completely dry into the skin.
again i'm going to give my face a few minutes to hair dry so if you don't have the patience for hair drying your face you can go ahead and use a paper towel or your regular towel to get rid of the moisture and now we're moving on to the final step which is applying the CeraVe moisturizing cream now at the start of the video i mentioned that this cream moisturizes and helps to restore the protective skin barrier it has hyaluronic acid so you know that helps to retain the skin's natural moisture and it has no fragrance to it and it won't clog your pore so this step is just to help to pretty much give your skin that moisturizing feel and that glowy look to it because the process can tend to dry your skin a bit especially with the aloe vera so i'm just going to go in and apply some to my hand and apply that in a circular motion to my skin and that is pretty much my skincare routine in a nutshell this is pretty simple yet it is effective and i like to end this process by applying some lip balm to my skin to help give my skin that soft and shiny look to it but that's pretty much the end of the video let me know what you guys think and rate my skincare routine on a scale of 1 to 10 so that's pretty much the end of the video and until next time bye my loves